Hello, this is Redbeard the Kilted Rider. My real name is Andrew Clayton, and I'm currently serving in the United States military as a U.S. Navy corpsman. These next couple of videos are going to document of a 7,000 mile cross-country motorcycle trip I took all on a Harley Sportster 1200. I took 30 days of leave to complete this trip, and I managed to complete it in 23 days from Pensacola, Florida to Rescue California. Enjoy. YouTube, it's Redbeard the Kilted Rider. Today's the big day. Going on my big ride today. So I got everything packed. I'm just gonna start probably painting my face, get my kilt on, and get on the bike, and we'll hit the road. So a little update, my little gas station made up around 100 miles. Don't know where, I don't even know what the town is on that. But as you can see, just a little gas station, nothing too fantastic. It's probably all this vlog is gonna be just gas station to gas station. Normally don't ride like this, normally ride on the back roads. I see all the sights, but I'm just trying to make as many miles as I can today. Hopefully I can make around 600, but we'll see how far I get. Well, I am too Shit's just going by. I'm on the side of the interstate right now with a flat tire. You probably can't see it, but I'm gonna go look through it. Felt the whole back, uh, the back rear tire swaying when I was riding, pulled over. It's a flat. Try to call AAA, because I had AAA for a damn reason. They told me they don't cover my motorcycle, which is the only vehicle I have. So I got off, I've been in a big argument with them, but I'm trying to get insurance. I'll be active for 48 hours. So I called a different tow trucking company. He's probably gonna charge me an arm and a leg to get me 10 miles on the road to a truck stop. Damn, this is, we'll see where I go from here. <laughs> well, That's why I do this crap for unexpected things, I guess. I wish I knew that insurance. Oh well. Well, the tow truck's here. This is me on the side of the road. Let's see what's going on.
I, he said, no, I had underwear. He goes, uh, now, he said, I took them off so they got hot, so now I'm like, real style. Uh, um, you'll be upset, and there's going to be a lot of ladies going, woo, <laughs> Along with the damn interstate there. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it was awesome. <laughs> I, went out, I went out there and I went, I'm trucked over right there. And I looked at you. Really? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's in line to be worked on that. Yeah. <laughs> It's been very interesting lately. Got a new tire on the bike. It's all set to go again. Packing everything up after that big ass ordeal of getting a flat tire in the road. Almost having to pull over. I had an ambulance pull up to me thinking I was a biker who went down. I had two cops pull up to me. Finally got a tow truck to me. My AAA didn't cover my toe. I had to cover it myself, which is a total BS. I'll probably go over later. But right now I just want to hit the road again, kill some time, give me a little update. I'm right outside this Har Dolphin Harley, Harley Davidson of Dolphin, Alabama. Really nice people, really good people. Gave me, helped me out. I still pay and stuff, but they get helped me out of a tough situation. Got my bike fixed real fast. I asked why I got a flat, and they said I probably had too much weight on the tire and couldn't handle it. So we learned they got a better tire on, so I can't be cheap now probably why I was going cheap on it. So I'm probably gonna have to skip Key West now too. And just go straight to Jacksonville and go north. All right, let's keep going. Man, you be careful on your trip, huh? I will. The you. Lord wants you to take care of this young man on his road up north. Lord, to get the rubber side down, shiny side up. Amen. Oh, thank you. Go for it, bud. <laughs> I will. So I'm gonna probably try to do some more on this vlog on the bike because I'm running out of daylight. I'll probably have to finish it up after I pitch tent, uh, camp and stuff. But I have one rough first day with a flat tire. The Harley guy said it was too much weight on the tire, so that's I shouldn't have got cheap tires. Always try to get the name brand when you're doing something like this. The Harley guys thought it was super funny though. One of the Brit Phil, the British guy, ran up to me and said, Oh, how does a ginge like you go down the ten with a uh, kilt on and not be burned alive? And I had to explain to him I had some underwear on that was covering my legs for most of the day, so I was kind of cheating. But anyway, I'm just finishing it up here. But actually, it's not finished. I'm probably going to go do one last vlog at the camp for today. I'm in, I made it all the way to Tallahassee, even with all the delays and everything. Hopefully I can make it to Jacksonville tomorrow and see a friend. But we'll see. I'm just going to sign off now. Alright, so uh, stay at a campsite tonight. I'm out kind of near this lake. It's very beautiful. I'm probably going to take the drone out. But, um, yeah, it's been pretty, it's been okay. <sighs> Yesterday I had to do that whole towing situation. That killed a lot of my fun, so I'm not going to be going to Key West. I'm just going to be going straight to Jacksonville so I can take my time today. I'm at the grand total. Yesterday I spent $30 on what I normally do. But with towing and everything, that was an extra 500 so that really knocked into everything. And, well, it was an adventure, I guess, for the first day, and that's what you get with this stuff. So I'm going to probably take the drone up. I'll show you the campsite in a little bit, and we'll go from there. So 
I'm about to tear down camp. Big thing, keep track of all your shit. Spent 30 minutes trying to find my, all my shit. Just a pain in the ass. Well, might as well get going. A little update. I'm an uh, hour and 30 away from Jacksonville, maybe a little more. Mm, been riding almost most of the day now. Haven't really made up too much time. So I'm just trying to make it to the Jacksonville and meet up with a friend of mine. I got uh, rained on. Went through a lot of flowers, which was kind of cool. I got some good footage today. <clears throat> what else happened? Nothing too terribly exciting. Trying to make my way there, I guess. Let's see. made it to Jacksonville, but I couldn't get a hold of that friend of mine. Uh, cause I don't know why I, he just hasn't responded. It might be, he might be working. But um, I went over to this little um, tourist area, I guess, and it was some cultural heritage sites. I don't even remember what they were because they were about closed around I got there. But um, yeah, let me through this trail path and I was gonna probably put some footage up on that and vlog while I go down it. And then I'm just testing out other little places I can put my camera at. I have um, like this one, this one weird ass mount that puts it on the side of my helmet. And then way far out, I'll put footage of that because I'm recording right now for it. So I'm basically just talking right now. I'm probably going to go over to Harley or check out the sites as I can. See what's around Jacksonville, and then I'm gonna head up to Beaufort tomorrow. I'll see where I end up tonight. Probably I'm gonna end up in a Walmart parking lot. I'll probably sleep in there, and if not, if I end up somewhere else, that's fine too. Just a place to sleep is all I want. I gotta get a few things from Walmart as well. But yeah, this, place, this this path gets pretty gnarly at some points. But yeah, today's been crazy with the rain. First time I've ever went uh, 70 going through the rain in a kilt. That hurt like hell. And um, I'm just trying not to fall right now. Things are going far, decent so far. Yeah, I gotta get this mount off. This thing is, it's annoying. We're gonna end it with Dr. Cross! <laughs> <laughs>